Kakashi was a bad sensei. Now, it can't be understated that Kakashi is one of the most beloved Naruto characters in the Naruto verse. Even he at one point was my favorite, so much so that I had him as a profile picture in my CG Scrubs YouTube channel. However, upon further analyzation of his character, there is one thing about him that gets overlooked, even though it's what he is most known for, and that he is the sensei of the Team 7, albeit a trash one. Now, this isn't to say that he was a useless sensei, far from it. He was the one that lived up Team 7 from the ground up, like when he taught them about chakra control during the Land of Wave arc. But after that, I noticed a bit of favoritism was being linked to more on Sasuke than his other teammates. Sasuke was the one who got special training when it came to the finals of the Chunin exams. Kakashi literally stated that he was training Sasuke because he felt just like him. Maybe it was also to make note that the curse mark wasn't going to take over Sasuke, but it still sucks that Naruto didn't get help from Kakashi during this time period. Kakashi ended up passing Naruto over to Ibusu since he is a highly trained ninja or whatever, but still Kakashi could have taught Naruto way more than him, but whatever I guess. It wasn't until later in Shippuden after Sasuke left the village that he was willing to train Naruto with making his new wind style version of the Rasengan. Crazy though that this was now the time that he decided to pay attention to Naruto after his star pupil decided to train with the ninja version of EVP. But if I were to peel this back even further, you can make the argument that Kakashi barely helped Naruto during the training since Kakashi told him to form shadow clones in order to have them retain the info for the training, basically saying to Naruto that you gotta figure this out on your own. But hey, at least some effort was given to the male students of Team 7, Sakura ended up getting the short end of the stick. Now as Naruto fans, I'm sure most of us don't technically have an issue with this since most of us are not fond of Sakura, but what if getting some proper training for Kakashi would have resulted in us liking her more as a character? How cool would it have been if we had seen Sakura pull off the water dragon jutsu, as opposed to what she basically does now, which is like punching holes in the ground. Going back to Sasuke, while you can definitely say that his training with Kakashi for the Chunin exams was sufficient, it has had a negative effect going forward. While Sasuke ended up learning the Shidori, it ended up being Sasuke's main jutsu to rack up some damage to the ninja world, specifically when it came to fighting in the 5 Kage Summit. Kakashi knew that Sasuke had something dark in his heart, yet he literally taught a jutsu to Sasuke that literally jabs other people's hearts. I guess Kakashi doesn't care about other ninja's hearts, since everyone close to him was already dead. I mean, he made sure of that. Bobby, Bobby. Overall, Kakashi had the potential to be the best sensei in the entire show, but was more neglectful than the third Hokage was towards Naruto. Yeah, no, that's kind of cap, but I feel like if Kakashi implemented more time into training the students evenly, I might have seen them more as a better teacher overall. But instead, the children had to receive training from a pervert, a ninja version of EDP, and a woman. <laughs> So what about you guys? Do you think Kakashi was a sufficient teacher to Team 7? Or do you think there was more to be desired when it came to him training his students? Let me know in the comment section below. I'm the Curly Haired Okage, and I hope you all have a great and blessed day. Peace.